At the recent meeting of the United Nations Security Council, China's Deputy Permanent Representative to the United Nations, Geng Chuang, called on the Houthi group in Yemen to immediately and unconditionally release UN personnel detained in Yemen. Following dozens of attacks in the Red Sea, the Chinese representative also urged the Houthis to respect the rights of commercial vessels of all countries to sail in the Red Sea under international law, to cease acts of harassment, and to maintain security in the Red Sea waters. He called on all parties concerned to exercise restraint and refrain from actions that could increase tensions. China, which supports the Yemen government's efforts to develop the economy and improve the livelihoods of its people, called on the international community to increase humanitarian assistance to Yemen and to alleviate the humanitarian crisis in the country and hopes that donors will fulfill their pledges as soon as possible. Hans Gunberg, the UN Special Envoy for Yemen, reported that 13 UN staff and five international NGOs had been detained by the Houthis in the past week. UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres has urged the Houthis to respect international law and immediately and unconditionally release all UN and NGO personnel and to avoid arbitrary detention of civilians.